What's up guys, we're here at AMC Town Square with Chasing Cinema, Mr. James Shoe. Com. And today we're going to be talking about, as you see already, Hell or High Water. Chris Pine. Yes. Uh, ben Foster. Mm. Jeff Bridges. Um, bank robbers. Bank robbers. What are you expecting out of this? Well, I am expecting a lot of good things because I've heard nothing but good things. That Rotten Tomato score is just banging. I've heard <laughs> from many a people that this is the, like, the best movie of the year right now. Wow. And I'm really excited to see it. However... Uh, I've not seen it, or I'm not going to see it. I'm going to watch Sully. You're going to watch Hell or High Water. So I'm really excited to see or to hear what you have to say. Well, hopefully I give you a good review, my man. Yeah, let's see it. Let's see if it's going to be Hell or High Water. Well, I guess they're both not good situations. Oh yeah, because High Water. <laughs> you know, you're like uh, yeah. through Hell or High Water, so they're both negative. But let's see if it's not Hell or High Water. <laughs> All right, so we just got a Sully available to watch right now. But this review is about Hell or High Water. This movie is the ultimate slow burn. Ooh. Like, it's so slow, dude, but... From the writers of Sicario. Just the... Oh, yeah, but... See, I wanted to watch this movie. One, I didn't even want to, I didn't really want to watch this movie. <laughs> I, 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 I genuinely didn't want to watch it, but... Bank Robbers, okay. Chris Pine, okay. Sicario Writers, okay. No, it was, it was, it was good. So, I, I can't say... I really liked it, and or I can't I say I loved it. it, but it was good. It's just a really, really slow, slow burn. Um, but overall, yeah, it was a good movie. Chris Pine did his thing, and uh, you know, because it's, it's based in today, and it's kind of scary because it shows you what um, certain parts of America look like still, <laughs> and it's, it's it's real. You know, yeah. there's nothing lying about it. It's, it's how it is, and. There's a line from the movie that freaking, I wanted to just, after I heard it, I wanted to jump out of the theater, take my clothes off, and just run around the theater. I was so excited. It was something, oh, dang it. I've had that happen many times. Yeah. Like, Not me doing it, but having that feeling. <laughs> Otherwise, I wouldn't be welcome here anymore. Um, but, and I'm, I, I, I know I'll get this line wrong, but it's something like, um, oh, it's such a good line. The line is something like, uh, poor is, being poor is a disease. Oh crap, I can't remember it. That's how good it was. <laughs> you hyped but everyone up. I still, I, it really was good. And it was, but it's basically saying that being poor is the disease and my family will never be poor again. And when I heard that, I was just like, oh, oh yeah, yeah, that's actually, you uh, know, that's actually, um, being uh, poor, I've always, I've been poor my whole life and poor is the disease, uh, is the disease and my family will never be poor. And it's something like that, I'm paraphrasing, I'm sure. But when I heard that line, like, because I'm that business guy, I was just like, dang, because it's so freaking, it's, yeah. It's it's frightening, and to see like, and I know that this story, when they talked about the banks, and this isn't a spoiler, but the banks try to play these games, and uh, which is the premise of the film. It's just like I know that crap goes on, and it's all no matter whose point of view, it, it's a business. And uh, yeah, overall though, a okay, I liked it. Uh, for me, definitely not top ten, performance wise. Uh, like Chris, no one like super stood out. No, it, Good, maybe my problem was it was I just thought it was such a slow movie. When you say slow burn, is it like uh, like a long stick of dynamite where you just and then you have a big boom at the end, or is the entire thing kind of a very slow pace? The whole thing for oh, me so was so there's not slow even like pace. a big kaboom, kaboom at the end. Like Sicario, like really yeah, kicks in a high yeah, gear. Yeah, yeah, there's. A, I mean, the ending, the the brother, without a doubt, is like the hero. Yeah. Yeah. The 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 brother was the, like that's that's a brother. <laughs> That's a freaking brother, dude. Like, I, I did a quote, quote of the day today about um, how this one guy I used to know um, really, uh, I felt, did me wrong. Is what that quote was about today. And so, and you look at the film, like, Hell or High Water, that's a freaking brother, dude. Yeah. Yeah, that, this character was like, dude, are you kidding me? And then it, that, so you'll see when you see the ending, but. And you can see all of Mr. Chu's quote of the days right on his channel. Click that wide eye. You can find his channel. Learn something, you know? It, the movie reviews are fun, but take some education out of this man. And we try. He's a valuable resource. But yeah, overall though, good movie. I definitely absolutely recommend watch it. I am really excited to see this movie. I am hopefully going to track it down in the next week or so and get myself watching it. As we all know, I have some catching up to do. But we also are getting hit with a lot of movies. This next week we're going to be joined, uh, be watching uh, Joseph Gordon-Lovett in uh, Snowden. Pumped. Uh, we have Bridget Jones's baby. Not pumped. <laughs> yeah, not pumped for you. And uh, the new Blair Witch movie, which I'm I'm actually really interested in, just because I just think it's an odd time. I think it's an odd choice. So I'm really excited to see where we're going with that. 
Um, I did my week 35 update, you can check that out. Our review for Sully is up. I'm trying to think of what else I wanted to say. Oh, oh but just really quick, so you, so you like Sicario better than Hell or High Water. Sicario is number three on was your it? list? Yeah, four? it was, yeah. Because I think ours is the same, because yeah, Sicario it, was like number three or four on my that list. That movie was freaking fan freaking fan. And the tension in Sicario was just like, oh my gosh. <laughs> this movie was it's not true. bad. Okay. But it was, it was good. Watch it. I'm excited to see that movie. Support and, film. Um, Watch it. Do it. Watch it. There's a lot of stuff out right now, um, and it's about to get really insane because we're going to turn this corner where we have some really good stuff, and then we're going to have award season stuff. So get ready to be going to the movies a lot. A lot of reviews are coming to this channel. Um, but yeah. Love it all. ChasingCinema.com is known as Film Lover's website.